hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl olivia and today i'm here with a colorful cut crease tutorial you guys look at that it is bold and beautiful okay so if you guys want to see how i created this look just keep on watching so the first thing i did is i take this uh pro concealer by la girls and it's in the color creamy beige and i put that on my lids just to act as a primer as a base for my shadows now i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna use a brush and i'm just gonna blend that out lightly Now that we have that blended out, I'm going to take my Morphe 35B palette and I'm going to go with the darker purple right there. I'm going to go exactly into my crease with this. I'm probably a little bit over my crease, but we're just going to start from our crease. And I'm packing this on just to get the maximum uh, color. Now that we have some color added to our crease, I'm going to go back in with that same palette with that pink color. I'm just going to put that above that color. I'm going to use that same uh, pattern motion to apply this. And then I'm going to use the same brush and go in circular motions just to blend it out a little bit. So the look I had in my head guys, I was thinking of just leaving it at its two colors, the pink and the purple, but I thought, hey, let me add some yellow. So I go back in with that same palette, added that yellow right there. I'm just going to pat it in as well and then blend in circular motions just to diffuse the lines a little bit. Okay, so now that our yellow is added on and everything is blended out it's time to cut our crease and I'm taking that same creamy beige concealer and I'm just gonna go a little bit over my crease area because we want this to be a bold look so I'm going just a little bit higher than my uh, normal crease cut would be and we're doing a full cut crease so I'm gonna go all the way through So guys here we have our crease cut and ready I did the other eye off camera and now we're just gonna set it with some translucent powder and um, yeah be ready for our lid colors so I'm gonna take the Javia Saharan um, volume 2 palette I think it is and I'm gonna go with the lighter shade pink and I'm gonna put that all over my lids
Okay guys, so the color is on our lids and it's time for some liner and I'm using the NYX black liner. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make a really big dramatic wing. You guys, you'll see. let me tell you this guys this is like life and death like my hands are not sturdy okay so oh my god um, I decided to add some glitter to my crease so I'm using this silver glitter which is gonna look like a lavender looking color because of the purple in my crease but hey we needed some bling bling okay Okay guys, so we have our bling bling on and with a snap of my fingers, so are my lashes, okay? Could not have done my lashes on camera, you guys. I cannot say this enough. My real lashes, too curly. It would be a waste of time. So I'm just adding some black liner in my waterline and then I'm going to smudge that out with the same colors that I use in my crease in that same order. Okay guys, we're going to take a minute, um, step back from our eyes, focus on our face for a bit. And I'm just taking my um, brush and I'm just removing all the excess powder that is on my face. And we're just going to take some orange blush and we're just going to warm our cheeks up just a little bit. And this blush I think is from NYX. I think it's called Dare to Wear. Something like that. I put it in the description bar below. Okay guys, now it's time for some highlights and I'm using the uh, Maybelline Master Chrome and this is in gold, rose gold. So we're just going to put that on the eye spots of her face or wherever we want to glow, okay? And I glow everywhere. You guys know this. I love highlighting. Okay guys, now it's time for our lippies and I'm going with this brown um, liner and I'm just going to line my lips. Um, actually, I'm going to put this all over my lips and then I'm going to go with the Rihanna Fenty Beauty um, Nude. I think it's in Up To No Good. I'm just going to put that in the center of my brown.
Okay guys, now that our lips are on, um, I have this trick that I do. I think most of you guys know it as well. But whenever you have a pimple that like out of place, I mean every pimple is out of place. But you know, it's just right there just making your makeup look, uh, oh my god. You just add some liner on top of that and you make a beauty mark. This is time for our final touches and I'm using the MAC Fix Plus all over my face and here you have it or a colorful cut crease look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think about this look and I'll keep them coming. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Subscribe guys.